everyone welcome to journey with data so today i'll talk about chat gpt and how we can use it to make our life simpler well the purpose is all about using chat gpt wisely and as you know that internet these days is buzzing with excitement over the capabilities of chat gpt it's a milestone released by open ai it has already gained popularity with million of users now so OpenAI is the same company which has already developed some influential models like DALI 2 in the past. So ChatGPT is basically an artificial intelligence model which has been designed to have human-like conversations in real time. You can use it for a variety of purposes like finishing a sentence, writing poetry, song, text summarization and what not. So let's see how we can benefit from ChatGPT and make our life simpler. Usage number one would be ability to generate code. So ChatGPT is basically capable of generating codes depending on the use case. So as you can see, I've passed a prompt, which is a Python function to detect null values. Now see how ChatGPT generates the code along with proper explanations. And it is always advisable to check your code and to test your code before using it. So this is just an example. Not only this, you can generate prototypes or sample codes for your machine learning models as well. So this, the, the list is endless. We should be mindful while using, while copying any codes from ChatGPT. It is always advisable to test your codes and then use it. So uh, coding ChatGPT, this only helps to serve as a prototype. And this area is still an, under an active research and it is not at all recommended for critical systems. This will help you to serve as a baseline. So another instance where you can use ChatGPT is in automating tedious tasks. You can use ChatGPT to automate tasks like sending an email, scheduling a workflow, to perform web scraping. You can benefit most out of ChatGPT by combining it with some external platforms like websites, mobile applications, and whatnot. Third instance where ChatGPT can help you is in educational content it can help you generate quizzes let's say you are interviewing someone and you also want the maximum participation from the audience as well so in this situation chat gpt can help you pre-generate some questions for you the fourth instance where chat gpt can be helpful is in improving business operations in uh, providing a virtual customer service. As you know, that ChatGPT is designed to have human-like conversation in real-time manner. So many businesses can create chatbots, which in turn can handle wide varieties of tasks. They can answer frequent questions and assist with customer inquiries as well. So this is another area where uh, ChatGPT can be helpful. The fifth use case where ChatGPT can be helpful is in generating test cases. ChatGPT can be very helpful for QA engineers as it can help in generating base test cases and the corresponding negative scenarios as well, all depending on how you provide the prompt. I've passed a prompt to verify the application login. So here you can see that the ChatGPT is generating test cases and some preconditions and the steps and the corresponding expected result. The sixth use case where ChatGPT can help you is in text summarization and generating insights from data. So generally, generating summaries from a very long article can be time consuming. And this is where ChatGPT can help you in generating summaries while maintaining the richness of the document and highlighting the key points. Now, there are a number of ways to summarize a document. Number one would be uh, to write in a plain text format like summarize atomic habits for me. So here I've passed a prompt to ChatGPT to summarize atomic habits. Now, notice how ChatGPT is summarizing this. It's a book by James Clear that focuses on the power of small consistent changes and so on. So this is how it is uh, generating the summary of this. Let's say if you have a document or a data set that's hosted somewhere, you can utilize that data set to generate insights from ChatGPT as well. The seventh use case where ChatGPT can be helpful is in fixing the code, in writing comments, and increasing the productivity and improving the readability of the code. Now, ChatGPT can help you in fixing the code and generating explanations. 
It can assist you in troubleshooting, understanding the error messages and identifying the issues with proper explanations and examples. It can also offer suggestions on how to correct the error. It can also improve the readability by writing the comments for the code. Some other interesting areas where ChatGPT can be used is in the field of music composition. It can be a very helpful tool for songwriters, music producers. It can also generate humorous content. It can also help you in uh, brainstorming ideas as well. So ChatGPT has many uses and I've named a few of them. But we should always be mindful while using, while copying any uh, content and using such content. Because even within the AI community, there is an opposition to the famous chat GPT. Prestigious conferences like machine learning, International Conference on Machine Learning is banning the use of tools like chat GPT to write papers. So here is a clarification that has been issued by ICML on LLM. It says, papers that include text generated from a large language model such as ChatGPT are prohibited unless the produced text is presented as a part of paper's experimental analysis. ICML believes that having publicly accessible models like ChatGPT is a, an exciting innovation. It also warns that this rapid progress can have some un unanticipated consequences. Hence, we should be mindful while using or while copying any codes. So that was all about ChatGPT from my side. Do like, share and subscribe to the channel to stay updated for more news on artificial intelligence and data science world. Thank you so much.